What? Wait a minute. Every si are you kidding me? Every one of those colored lines is a mouse error. Holy. What's up guys, it's Crash. And before we get into the mouse input issues with Battlefield 2042, um, I just wanna ish issue an apology. I know a lot of my subscribers came in the lead up to Battlefield 2042 and I wrestle with this every day on what to do with the channel. And I know a lot of you came to the channel expecting Battlefield University and content on 2042, uh, weapon guides, map guides, tactics, how to get better and stuff like that. And I just wasn't able to play the game as much as I need to to make good content for you guys and if you came to the channel for that and feel like you got a bait and switch I'm incredibly incredibly sorry I apologize with uh, I apologize uh, to you for that and I wrestle with that every day mentally um, not kind of following through with what I said that's a big deal to me and I, I, I sincerely apologize for those of you who have stuck with the channel Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. We're still talking about FPS games, uh, news and things that are coming down the pipeline. The live show on Monday is a ton of fun and I just appreciate that. And who knows, one of the games coming out in the future might be something that we dive into really deep and uh, make content about and get better at. Um, just a lot of those things, uh, the, the, the lack of maps and stuff like that we all know about. But one of the major things is how you actually aim in the game is broken so it's 249 days since the game came out and we are still talking about how you aim in the game so let me show you guys what i'm talking about all right guys so how we're going to do this how we're going to illustrate the issue with battlefield 2042 is on the right side of the screen you guys can see a mouse movement recorder and what that does is the left column is how far the mouse has moved and then the software also measures how far the pointer moves on the screen and as far as um any issues will come up they will be highlighted on the screen if they stay black that means that the mouse has matched the the pointer matches where i move the mouse so just to test it out a little bit um i'm on a, a twitter page fps underscore crash if you want to drop a follow we're just chilling in the browser um little plug there but we can move the mouse around and everything looks good um every once in a while even i mean just of note it does throw an error every once in a while on on my system uh just moving windows around in the desktop but as you can see everything's staying uh, pretty chill um there's not any errors yet uh every once in a while it'll just throw one uh if we go over to the the twitch channel uh twitch.tv slash crash eight uh, you can move around and see that just chilling in here um, everything is looking pretty good if I move it crazy sometimes it'll throw an error but it's not even really throwing an error right now uh, moving my mouse around so let's go ahead and hop into a game I think we'll hop into rainbow six and see how it works there and then I'll show you guys what this thing does when you hop in a match of battlefield 2042 all right guys so here we are in rainbow six siege on the shooting range I just picked one of the operators and as you move around you can see that everything is looking pretty good every once in a while I will be honest it does throw a few errors although it doesn't feel like it on the screen um, it does throw a few of them from time to time uh, but it is pretty clean you don't see hardly any red or green uh, bars you see them every once in a while you just saw one there and uh, as we move it around it looks you know pretty good we can even go pretty fast we see a couple uh, little misses here and there but really not very much there was a little bit of green right there but overall pretty clean so this is what a game like rainbow six siege looks like when you're measuring mouse movement versus pointer position on the screen so let's go ahead and take a look at this in 2042 all right guys so here we are in 2042 in a in a conquest online match you guys can see what's going on and already for me moving the mouse around just a little bit in the game you can see every single one of those lines that is green and red is when there's a discrepancy between the movement on screen and how far i move the mouse on my mouse pad so you can see guys as i move around they are literally i mean it's just it's just insane how many errors there are i'm not a hundred percent sure on if this is the correct way to measure this but something is up i think there's something to my methodology where i tested it just in a browser on my system that we tested it in rainbow six siege and now i tested in this game and there is clearly a, a difference on how they're 
how this is computed uh something's going on here again this software uh is supposed to show us that pointer movement is not mount matching up with mouse movement so you can see um every time i move um it's just it's just not great and it doesn't feel good now i'm not saying this is the issue or i'm not even a hundred percent sure if this is correctly measuring uh what i think it's measuring but there is something here and either way there is a narrative for me that there is a bugged mouse input in 2042 and dice given their history they're not going to but they should come out and communicate hey we're aware you guys think this and either you know put out a blog post that says hey no it's not here's what's going on here's why this methodology doesn't work here's what's actually going on behind the scenes you can test it out and our input is good come out and say that if it is good if not say hey we hear you we're working on it we're going to get it fixed as soon as possible Possible. because honestly guys to, to to have these questions surrounding a first person shooter game this late in the development cycle it is absolutely laughable and in my opinion um it's unacceptable and borderline embarrassing um to be honest for a triple a franchise this is how you aim your gun in a first person shooter video game okay that seems pretty fundamental to me and we also know that in the next update in early august when they fix kaleidoscope finally that they're fixing they're supposedly fixing aim assist. So they've acknowledged and know that aim assist is still not functioning correctly and that's getting fixed in an upcoming patch. Let's talk about mouse input. This game does not feel good to play. And again, I'm sorry for those of you who joined the channel uh, to follow along with this game. I just don't want to support it. I want better for the Battlefield community and I, I, I want us to get to get treated better and, and, and respected more. And uh, yeah let me know what you guys think if this is really an issue um when you have stuff like this when you have some of the elite players like enders and baronox um saying there's issues those guys are so good at what they do and so precise in their aim and if it doesn't feel good to them something is going on okay so hopefully they'll address it i doubt they will but yeah let me know what you guys think thank you so much for sticking with the channel thank you so much for watching and we'll see you later